Hi guys, Astra here. Um, and because I am guided to deliver all of my information um, um, in a channeling format, <laughs> I am wanting to just get grounded and take a moment to just sort of anyone who might be watching now or in the future, just sort of gather your energy in towards your body to make sure that you, your energy is the only energy that is living within your aura, within your energy field. Um, and getting grounded and really in a space where, since I'll be channeling all my information, um, you'll be in a space where um, you will be most open to receiving it if that is your intention, if that is what you desire. And also to share that um, as you are receiving any information from me or guidance, uh, anything that I'm guided to share during this Facebook Live, um, that you make sure that you're in a grounded and meditative um, space physically. Um, because I know that I've had reports <laughs> from people who've received my vibrational um, transmissions, um, you know, that they're, that they can be strong and powerful. Um, and that, so I, I know for safety's sake, it's best for you to be in a space where you are grounded, like either laying down or just sitting comfortably back and you're, supported by whatever <laughs> receptacle is carrying you at the time. So in other words, no driving, no operating heavy machinery. <laughs> if you're a doctor, no operating, period. <laughs> um, and I'm just going to share what wants to come through divinely, as divinely guided, the messages. So <clears throat> the topic that... Um, came through for tonight. I'm sorry, my nose is suddenly itchy. <laughs> itchy, itchy. What does that mean? That I'm going to kiss a fool? <laughs> is, that a, is that a thing? That feels like, like some old fashioned nursery rhyme type thing. Pardon me while I scratch my nose. <laughs> Already it's a great Facebook Live. Astra scratches her itchy nose. Um, so yeah, so so the the theme or topic that I was guided to channel um, tonight is what it means to be a spiritual leader and how do you know if you are one? Um, and the primary reason I know that this has been guided to come through me tonight is that um, if you've well, if you haven't been following me for a while, you don't know this, but if you have, then you do know this, um, since the end of 2011, um, I, I've been guided to work primarily with um, spiritual entrepreneurs, you know, heart-centered entrepreneurs, soulpreneurs, we can call it a million things, but it's been basically, you know, um, spiritual healers, coaches, teachers, um, um, shamans, what I call good witches, because <laughs> that's the only kind I work with and that's the kind I am. Um, it, it, everyone that's it, messengers, you know, the messengers of earth, those of us who are here to make a positive impact and, and help in transforming earth into um, a place of peace and abundance and all the things that it already really is. It's just, you know, how do we access that? Um, how do we focus on that? Because what, what we focus on, we bring about. And, and so throughout the years, I've been um, supporting these spiritual entrepreneurial type people um, in coming out of their shell, in, you know, um, believing that they can prosper 
in in a spiritual type business setting um, um, connecting with their abundance and wealth energy um, you know and over the years i've called myself different things you know a shamanic life and business coach um a business shaman a money shaman and on and on and so forth so forth and so forth and really you know it's it's all what i am is an amalgamation of all those things um sort of compressed at this point into a little bit more of a diamond shaped <laughs> me um you know, just over, throughout, uh, as a result of years of um, learning and inner learning and experience and inner exploration and um, doing my thing, you know, with my peeps. Um, and so, so it's, it's come to my attention <laughs> fairly recently that at this point, um, who I the focus of who I now work with are uh, is um, those who are called to spiritual leadership on Earth in this lifetime, and and the vision I'm shown around that is, is that you know um, the new more modern version versions of the spiritual the spiritual leaders who have come before us who have paved the way for us and i'm talking like big names in in the <laughs> in the in the biz like wayne dyer deepak chopra marianne williamson is that her no not williamson is that her name i think so the one who wrote the thing who are we to be to fight to think we're beautiful and worthy and yada 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 marianne williams <laughs> i think that's right i get caught up in words sometimes and i i'm thinking that i'm saying the right thing and sometimes it's not but i think in this case i think it is um um louise hay that's always the other example that comes through so like they've been around a while they've been around the block they a couple of them aren't here with us anymore uh, you know obviously wayne dyer Lu uh, and louise hay um but you know they they took the messages and the teachings that were divinely being sent through them through the channels that they were or that they still are and they took that and they they ran with it and they opened up their dang throat chakras and just sang it from the rooftops you know and they they if they ever did have any fears of of um putting themselves out there and attracting their tribe members and 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 delivering the messages that they were here to deliver if they ever did have any fears they overcame their fears through the through the the actual divine teachings that were coming through them not only were they supporting their tribes folk um, in 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 healing themselves, but they, the spiritual leaders, were also being healed via the the transmissions that they were receiving, channeling, and sending out. It's a pretty beautiful thing. So, um, so yeah, I've been shown pretty pretty powerfully lately by my two main spirit guides, God and the universe, <laughs> you know, <laughs> the, these, those little guys. Um, and, and the, the way that they showed themselves to me and through me are God, the divine masculine and the universe, the divine feminine. Um, and that just works really well. They sort of dance together and swirl around and really make up the whole of all that is um you know and so when they when they when they show me the messages and and want them delivered through me i perk up and listen and um now more than ever and um so i've been shown very powerfully that i am here to work with what i call or what what is called the up and coming spiritual leaders of earth the new versions 
um, unique versions because each of us is unique, but the new versions of the Wayne Dyers, the Deepak Chopras, the Marianne Husamowatsis, <laughs> because I, I, I hope that I remember her name correctly. I'm gonna go back and find out that I said it wrong, but oh well. Um, the Louise Hayes, the, <coughs> you know, um, there's, there's others that, uh, yeah, I, I mean, like those are the those are always the biggies that show themselves. So I'm gonna stick with with them. Um, so we so and the reason that I'm called to work with these you guys, the up and coming spiritual leaders, um, is because I am a spiritual leader, and wow, like that's been quite a journey in and of itself for me to come to the point where I can say that and like be like yeah that's of course I am that's normal I've I've always been that you know but um it's a weird thing it's a it's a it's a weird graduation if you will um to step into the truth that you are a leader um teacher I knew teacher I've been for a long time you know healer shaman um spiritual coach type person but leader is different it's different it's new it's um and if you're on my email list you will know or you will ha maybe have read the email where um i was talking about the fact that i was given a message recently that tomorrow night at 11 11 p.m you will graduate and i was like oh okay that's funny because graduating is the perfect term because the I've had membership group, membership community groups for a long time, um, both paid and unpaid. But but it's been one of my sort of like um, baseline of services that I've always had, or not always, <laughs> not when I was like three, but <laughs> in the recent years, I've I've always had a a paid membership group, and um, the the new incarnation of the membership group is called create your university create your you your y-o-u university <laughs> so it's a university and so the fact that i was shown by my spirit guides that i was going to be graduating i was like oh i'm graduating my own university so that i can then be the spiritual leader who teaches from the platform and and it's just amazing timing and divine timing and not surprisingly so um because I really, I've really gotten to the point where I'm ready to do that. And so it all just sort of, as everything does, happened in divine timing. And, um, and yeah, so, okay, so <laughs> there's that. And so, so the, the gist or the, the theme of this Facebook Live is what does it mean to be a spiritual leader? Well, it means you lead. It means that everything you've ever learned and everything that you're here to teach, um, it's time. <laughs> if you're, if you know, if you innately hold the truth that you are meant to be a spiritual leader, you know, and you're, and you've been on the journey of healing yourself and, you know, working, maybe healing some or supporting some clients in healing and you've been you've taken many courses and classes and you've got a gotten a lot of certifications and you've um you've had a spiritual practice or business for for a while now you know and um but there feels like something's knocking at the door where there's like this next level that you're meant to to push through and to to step into you know sort of a, a deeper sense of empowerment of the teacher that you are here to be, the messenger that you're here to be. Um, if you're meant to be a spiritual leader, you will know that you are here to not just help, you know, one client at a, at a time as they come along, but you're really meant to broadcast your messages in a bigger way and be more visible and not be afraid to be visible and to be comfortable in your skin being visible. <laughs> um, and that's that's a that's a journey. Like I've gone through a lot on this journey to the point where I'm um, comfortable being visible. And even still, it takes me a while to like 
you know, get grounded and like before I know I'm going to, you know, do like a any sort of an e-blast or like a broadcast or anything like that. I do some work. I do some preparation work and it's 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 I'm not going to say it's hard, but it's like it's sort of a fun challenge at this point. It's um you know, but I honestly it it the journey itself has been really scary <laughs> to know that I'm here to share these messages with people that I don't even know like what but but that being said it's interesting and this is another part of um how do you know if you're here to be hello <laughs> i just want to share Hi. Um, I, I don't usually wear my reading glasses while I'm broadcasting. So if anyone pops in and says hi, and I, I, it sort of like goes over my head, don't be offended. <laughs> I just, um, I'm just sort of channeling and I will definitely, if you have any questions, definitely type them in, you know, or comments. And I, once the broadcast is up and running and I'm able to go back and read through the comments, I will respond to everything. I promise. Um, but, I, but, kisses. <laughs> um, so, oh, so yes, so another aspect of, um, and if you're just popping in, also be sure to go back and watch it from the beginning once it's over, <laughs> if that makes sense. Um, but another aspect of if you know you're here to, to be a spiritual leader, um, one of the things, and, and this might not be true for everyone, but but I have a feeling that that it's true for most of us is that somehow or another in the way back in the depths of our consciousness, we've somehow always known that we're here to share things in a big way, that we're here to do big things, even if we didn't know what that meant. Um, like I'll share a funny thing. When I was a lot younger, like, um, gosh, probably at least since I was like 14 or 15, you know, and da the, the D David Letterman show was on the talk, the, his nightly talk show, um, who I really love, by the way, um, even though he's got his quirks, but um, I was, I always felt like, you know, one, one day when I'm an adult, I'm going to be on the David Letterman show, which is now not physically possible because he's not on anymore. But <laughs> But that kind of thing, like, I, I'm i like, I felt really drawn, like, I'm going to be on that talk show, and I'm going to be talking about something really big. I think in those days, I thought that it would be about some movie that I was going to be in, because I was, I was into theater and acting and, and stuff back in high school. Um, but, but, but I just always had this sense that, like, I was going to be broadcasting in a big way out to the world and it was you know and then it sort of you know it didn't go away that that thought or that that divine calling didn't go away but it was sort of like resting in the back of my consciousness um and for a long time i didn't really think about it but but i always did on and off have these like little waves of like i i need to share something with a lot of people <laughs> So that could be that could be one sign that you know you're here to be a spiritual leader, especially if you already have a spiritual practice um, or some sort of spiritual teaching business or helping preneur business or or whatever you want to call it. Heart and soul centered entrepreneur, teacher, healer, yada yada yada. Um, it's it's yeah it's 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 like it's definitely a calling but we're not conscious of it until we are ready to allow ourselves to fully step in and embody it. Mm -hmm. So the people that I'm now here to help, um, now that I've gone through all these different mm -hmm. incarnations of helping my spiritual entrepreneurs be step into their abundance and their empowerment and be more visible, the new way to state the identity of my true tribe member is the up and coming spiritual leader of earth. Um, and again, I'll repeat that, that it's like, we're sort of the new, the new wave, the new versions of the Wayne Dyers of the Sonia Choquette. She's another spiritual teacher uh, the, of Louise Hay, um, Deepak Chopra, you know, and 
and we're here to do that and be that for our for this our new communities our new tribes and and that can feel scary so that so my job is to be a catalyst for your own abundance and empowerment energy and power so that you know that you deserve to be successful you know that it's possible for you to step into that to step into what i call soul soaring success because it's success as a spiritual being it's success via the sharing of our spiritual spiritual messages gifts and truths um and that is what it means to be a spiritual leader and the yeah yeah i'm trying to trying to you know as always i channel teachings as i'm going along i don't have a script so i'm just checking in energetically is there anything else that i need to say about that and i'm getting a big no 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 <laughs> okay well that that you know that feels clear enough as always if if you have any questions um, or comments, please do stick them in the comments of this Facebook Live so that I can absolutely be sure to get back to you um, and channel the answers. And so I did want to mention, um, I, I, well, I already mentioned my, my new, the new incarnation of my, of my business uh, membership community. Um, for the up and coming spiritual leaders of earth and it's called create your university your yo university um, and you can you can find all the information um, and sign up info um, at www.createyouruniverseyouniverse.com forward slash you yo <laughs> so wait i think i i don't know how clear this is going to be but or maybe not at all. Create your you, your youuniverse.com forward slash you. Create your universe.com slash you. Um, and I just, I'm not going to talk, I'm <laughs> putting my reading glasses on upside down. That's great. I'm not going to talk tons about it um, because there really is the description on the page is is very clear i think <laughs> i spent a really long time putting it together um but i just want to read and share one section of it and it, it's about what we work on together and first of all the the support that i give via this membership it's not standard business coaching it's total vibrational support for your abundance empowerment and success as a spiritual leader. Okay, so what we were, okay, I'm gonna read this little section. What we work on together vibrationally for your whole soul success is, and here's the checklist, your money, abundance, and prosperity vibration, your empowerment, owning your truth and being who you are, your confidence as messenger in this lifetime, your journey into courageous living, I love that, your visibility comfort zone, big one <laughs> for spiritual leaders, right? Your relationship with self slash self-love, which then positively carries over into relationships with your tribe members and others in your life. Your whole health and wellness on all levels of your being, your inner peace, and then I, I wrote hashtag inner peace for world peace is one of my mottos. Um, your trust in yourself and God slash universe slash the force slash the power of creation. <laughs> so trust is a big, big issue um, in when you're creating your whole soul success. Your unique manifesting and creation power that you may design your divine biz abundance relationships and life intentionally in every moment. Your ability to heal yourself and any situation at all times in every way. And the healing, happiness and comfort of your animal babies. 
who support you in so many ways, seen and unseen. Let's shower them with healing and love. So yes, I include, you know, um, if if my my if the members of my membership community does so desire, I include your animal children um, in every weekly uh, energy healing that I do, and I and I I perform a, a weekly energy healing, distance healing for the group every week. So your animal babies are covered there if you want them to be. So I don't I don't know anyone else who does that <laughs> in their in their um, spiritual entrepreneurial business memberships. So pretty unique um but there it is so but again you can you'll go there to the page um bam where are we create your youuniverse.com slash you <laughs> so i just wanted to touch on that and and one of the cool things about the group is that i it, I'm going to take these off because they're so shiny in the light there. Um, I really wanted to create a space where I could share every product and service and program that I've ever created in one space. And also, in that same space, share every course and program that I'm creating now and in the future in that same space. So it's truly a university because there are many classes and courses and, you know, nooks and crannies and libraries and archives. And, you know, um, I mean, every, every money and prosperity course that I've ever given is provided in one of the um, library archive spaces. Um, two years worth of master classes, two years worth of empowerment sound healings, um, you know, there are meditations and ebooks and PDFs and I mean literally everything that I've been creating the past few years and even sometimes further back than that. Um, and I add more stuff all the time. So <laughs> this this membership is my favorite thing I've ever created. And anyone who's feeling the call to be a spiritual leader and who is um, experiencing any timidity about that um, or lack of confidence or just wants the vibrational support to step into your abundance and empowerment now so that you can flow into your soul soaring success so yeah that's the membership and um, again any questions about that as well I'm happy to reply at any time um, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> one last thing I forgot I almost forgot thank goodness I didn't forget um Starting a week from now, so next Monday, which is, I think, I believe May 6th, um, we begin a two-month program in the membership community. Um, and it is my new, oh gosh, I'm, I get lightheaded thinking about this. It's it's my my healing program. I've never given it before. It's It's one of the most powerful things I can feel in my heart and my body that I've ever created. Um, it's called um, Well, Wise and Worth It, The Boundless Journey to a Healthy You. And what it is, is that I will be teaching everything I've ever learned about healing oneself. Because I don't know if you know this, you might, um, if you've read about me at all. But um, over the years on my own healing and empowerment journey, I've healed myself from over 13 chronic physical ailments that were, some of them were lifelong. Um, and I healed myself from them with no medication whatsoever, purely using vibrational energy healing and vibrational um, medicine, but it's not, not Western medicine, you know, vibrational healing tools, I, I guess I will say. Um, and, and so I, so I know that it's possible to not be sick, to not have chronic ailments physically. Um, and I'm going to share all I've ever learned about not only healing from those, but about having all the tools and I'll be teaching all the tools that are needed to have, you know, so that you can have them in place 
to also not only heal from ailments that were already there, but to prevent further, to prevent future ailments from ever cropping up. And um, and I will be where anyone who's going through this healing program, um, if you if you yourself have unique or specific ailments that you want my assistance or guidance in healing from, I will be working with you individually within the group. Um, you know, in addition to teaching everything that I am here to teach about healing. So you can learn and heal <laughs> at the same time that you're learning how to heal. And then you can take the tools that you learn from the, in, the materials that I'm going to be teaching and not only use them for yourself, but use them in your practice to support you in empowering your clients and your tribe members to heal. So ta-da! <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> I'm really excited. Um, I'm gonna, I'll be sharing more about that, but that's, you know, I think that's a pretty pretty solid description of what the class is going to entail. And please feel free to ask about that. And again, that's going to be taught within the membership group itself. And and so even if you just join to be to do the two month program, you still get access to every am amenity, all the gifts and all the classes that I, you know, that I've described and that are described on the um, on the page that I've that I shared the link to. I'll throw the link in the comments too. Um, so that while you're there, you know, wh while you're staying at the Create Your University Resort Spa, <laughs> you'll you'll receive full amenities and you know room service in your energetic rooms. Um, so I'm just oh gosh, I'm just so happy and excited. So yeah, that's what's happening and and that's it. I'm gonna stop here because I think I shared everything that I came here to share today. All right guys. Mwah. Goodbye. <laughs> Ask your questions. Okay. Okay, sending love. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Transmitting.